He is an outstanding uh, executive and leadership coach. He works with clients all over the country. It is always my pleasure to bring him up. Paul. Thank you. Thank you. At Good Leadership Enterprises, we believe that the path to greatness is paved by good leaders like you and me who are radiating goodness today and every day. Goodness pays because goodness grows. Look at this room. We are living the mantra. When good leaders work together with good intentions, that's when great things happen. And at 11 years old, when my aunt took me to buy me my first pair of soccer shoes, I filled out a raffle ticket at the counter of a Kokesh. It's a sporting goods store we used to have here. And I won, one in six million, I won a trip to Pele soccer camp. So at age 11, I get to go to New York City, Pele soccer camp. Let's rewind. So, in 1982, my mom was ahead of the times. She was a yoga instructor. And my mom had signed me up for a yoga camp. <laughs> <laughs> and yoga camp was at the exact same time as Pele soccer camp. So guess where I was going? Yoga camp. On the field, I made all the rules because I was the captain as a senior. And I worked really hard. And my teammates respected me for that. Off the field, we were all equals. So when we would socialize, my rule was, if anybody asks you for a refreshment, you have to help your teammate. So if I was at a party with a freshman, a freshman would come up to the captain and say, Tony, would you get me a Pepsi or a glass of water? <laughs> I would gladly go to him. And sometimes they showed off in, the, in front of their friends, watch, I'm gonna go have Tony go get me a glass of water. But I thought it was very important that they knew that I respected them and that I was willing to wait on them because sports really is, the whole team has to, has to buy in. The guy kept coming to my games for four years and after I finished, he quit his job, started a pro soccer team and built it around me. And then he went on to be my mentor and my agent and when I needed more agents, he introduced me to people and he never asked for anything and he always worked on a handshake. And throughout my career, I have never signed a contract with any agent. I've only worked on handshakes. Um, so the point is, is that people always looked out for me and people always believed in me. And I think that's really important being a part of a team. Giving people the confidence to do what they want to do. I scored the championship goal the goal in the championship game and I looked up and I saw my 10 best friends behind the goal. It means so much to be able to bring joy to people. The other thing was in the World Cup, I'm doing the national anthem and I see my family up in the stands and I'm thinking there's a billion people watching this game. Only one game on in the world. And I'm kind of a big deal right now and they're all watching me. And then I started thinking about everybody my whole life that said bought me a pair of soccer shoes, or say, I know that guy, Tony, he's gonna be good, or you can do it. Everybody that ever vouched for me was sitting somewhere next to somebody saying, that's my friend, or I used to work with him. And it was a big thank you to them, because I believe we got to share that moment together. Thanks to all of you. This is the new record total for a day, $4,471. Fantastic. And with the so match. with the match, that makes it 8,942, which drives the total from breakfast one to today, 104,237. Fantastic. Thank you so much. Thank you. Leonard Siegel. Oh, Leonard Siegel from... Where's Leonard? Fantastic. Come on up here. So what I'd like to do is uh, donate this money to the U.S. Uh, Holocaust Memorial Museum, which uh, not only honors the Holocaust, but also all uh, forms of racism, anti-Semitism, and uh, uh, other um, bad conduct in the world. So, thank you. Thank you. Because we need to find ways to nurture and grow trust and to continue to earn trust. We believe in, in good leadership in business, 
and good leadership in the community. We think that good leadership at home uh, and in the community and in business benefits all of us. They talk a lot about goodness and how to stand out as a leader in your actions, your words, and everything else that you do. We're doing a selfie! <laughs> ha! <laughs> Having the excitement of excellence in our lives can really be fun, and that's why we sponsor this breakfast. I thank you for considering the idea that if you blend together the seven F's in your work life and home life, you can live with less stress and lead with less fear. I thank you for considering the idea that goodness pays. Are you ready to radiate goodness today? Are you ready to radiate goodness today? Yes. Thank you. We'll see you in November. Learn a lot, meet a lot of people. I love the networking. Similarly motivated to want to uh, spread goodness. Very inspiring. You get to hear about leadership and what they should be doing. I've handed out 30 business cards. I'm going into my Friday with momentum. I'm going in with energy. Thanks, Thanks good, good leadership, leadership breakfast. breakfast. Your name could be called, so be prepared, just in case. And if it's not called this month, it might be called next month, so, so always come prepared.